Gente Fina is a Latino-owned local streetwear brand that is gaining in popularity for their eye-catching phrases and graphics and use of Chicago-centric and Spanglish phrases. Joining us now with more are owners Manny Cabrera and Abraham Cortez. Thank you so much both for being here. Thank you. Abraham, what was the defining moment that made you decide, I'm going to create this brand? So we saw the lack of representation um, and we always wanted something. We had so much pride within our city and very little options to show off that pride with clothing. Mm -hmm. um, so when Manny and I would go shopping, we would see shirts with like New York, LA, Paris, Tokyo, but nothing with Chicago, nothing that can show off our pride. So Manny and I being creative entrepreneurs, we're like um, looking for new challenges. We're looking to build up our community. Let's roll up our sleeves and put our city on our sleeve. Well, and Manny, I admit, admit this has got to be a very scary venture to jump into. Like, okay, yeah. let's try and do this. We're in a big city. There's a lot of fashion here. Yeah. So uh, tell me what precipitated getting you guys to do this. Well, uh, we actually met about 15 years ago. Mm -hmm. And ever since then, we took like a spontaneous trip to New York when none of our friends were down to do something like that. So that kind of really, um, like really sparked the conversations about entrepreneurship and kind of our goals in life. And we have similar visions. Um, we're both very creative. His background with uh, graphic design, mm -hmm. my background with um, owning multiple businesses and just dealing with fabrics um, and dealing with the manufacturers. So it just made sense when the conversation came up four years ago. It's like this. This is what we gotta do. Yeah, so, and yeah. just cool. makes sense, you know. Yeah. yeah, and tell us about the name. How did you decide on Hinta Fina? Hinta Fina. So the industry that we wanted to pursue came organically and we knew what our messaging wanted to be, right? To show off Chicago, but we couldn't really land on a name. We had something like 150 names. Wow! Yeah. And nothing was hitting home. Right. So yeah. after Donald Trump's anti-Latino speech, um, we knew that we had something to prove and to really show what our culture and what our people are mm. about. And what we are is fine people. We are in the Yeah. Okay. All right, well, let's show the uh, fine audience out here. We've got mm -hmm. uh, some of your designs. You got some, brought some yes. models in. Yeah. All right, show us, tell us about this look. So Jordan here is rocking our varsity jacket. Uh, actually, one of our biggest sellers is the varsity slash bomber jacket. Mm -hmm. It has Chicago in the front uh, with till Chicago wins in the back. You can see the back right there. Uh, wow. This is one of our best, some of our best work right here with the heavy duty wool on the outside, uh, polyester interior, super soft, quilted. Um, it's actually satin, I'm sorry, and it's just it's beautiful. Very, cool. and very soft, quilted, so it's warm, really warm too. I saw this on your website. I love this sweatshirt. Oh, thank you. Yes, the hoodie. Uh, yeah. Kind of a, um, a rendition to just hard workers out there, especially yeah. here in Chicago. Heavy duty uh, cotton, very, very um, water resistant as well. So. And I'm guessing unisex, right? Yeah. Anybody yeah. can wear yeah. this. Absolutely. Well, the good thing about streetwear is you can, you know, wear a little baggy and it'll look cool, or you can wear it mm -hmm. fit true to size and it still looks great. Yeah. yeah. All right. Thank you very much. Let's take a look at the next look. Yes, I look love at this. Yeah, this looks so great. this is part of our current collection. This is our Chicago Works Harder collection. This is really to show off the work ethic here mm -hmm. in Chicago. I mean, everyone here is, is a hustler. They're humble, but they're always working nine to five, 24 seven. Um, and we want something that can keep up with, with the Chicago citizen. This is the new uniform for Chicagoans. Yeah, especially nowadays. Like, yeah, you're out there working and people are, you know, doing a little more from home and like this yeah. is the perfect time yes, to, type to exactly. wear. Yeah, and this drop we were able to mix a little bit of vintage wear, like yeah. the vintage Carhartt jackets and um, mixed with our, our brand. So these jackets were hand painted in the back. Oh, they were? Oh, um, awesome. At our shop. And you can see like the hoodie as well. We have those in uh, camo, we have it in uh, black and orange as well. Yeah, I'm feeling a little of the 90s in the, on the barn jacket. Yes. 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 But I <laughs> love too that this has been upcycled. Yeah. So you're finding so vintage. So one of our goals is yeah. to go completely upcycled within uh, uh, at least three years. Right now it's about 25%. We're looking at, um, you know, we're going to vintage stores, we're gathering everything. We're hiring vintage finders within the city as well to source some of these items. But great for sustainability, yeah. which is great. Exactly. Yeah. All right, thanks guys. Let's take a look at our last look here before we run out of time. Oh, the bag. Yeah, the bags are cool. So these are where you can really see where that upcycle comes into play. Yes, so these, uh, all these bags, we made a couple of them. They're all made from uh, original work pants, carpenter pants. Uh, we were able to, whatever fabric we didn't use, we were able to scrap it all together and make these cool, heavy duty, water resistant bags. So cool. So. Love the vest, too. It. All right, so tell us, uh, thank you so much. Tell us what's ahead for you guys. Yeah, let's bring yeah. everybody back on. So, Right now, our, our, 
our, our, I guess our close, like our um, our goals right now is to bring manufacturing to Chicago. Mm -hmm. So right now we're at about, uh, I would say 30 to 50%, depending on the drop, it's made with by us. But we would like for it to be 100%, you know, in Chicago yeah. with our own ma machinery, our own manufacturers. So that's kind of the long-term goal in the next to five years for sure. Well, and you guys are getting uh, plenty of buzz, but you said Barack Obama's worn your stuff before. Something yeah. like that, yeah. And A.O. Dose uh, recently had a custom jacket made by us that hopefully he wears soon. Um, <laughs> mm -hmm. It's still cold out, so jackets are still very much in season. Yeah, that is awesome. Nice. Wow, that's yeah. awesome. Good. Congratulations, guys. And if we want really a cool. custom painted jacket, is that something we have to order, or you just have them No, available? so we have, I think, okay. something like five left. We okay. had 10 up for sale. We have Great. a couple left, so if you do want to get yours, Go to hit the dash and, and cop. Uh, we also yeah. could take, um, like you said, if somebody wants some hand painted stuff, uh, my friend Abraham here, he can do it. <laughs> all, all right, right. let's talk, let's talk yeah, in the commercial up. break. Yeah. All, right. <laughs> all right, there's all the information for these guys on your screen. Visit the website, you can do some shopping there and their social media handles as well. Gentlemen, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for Absolutely incredible.